Right. Um, <laughs> oh, God. So this is the game that my good friend Georgie here has challenged me to play. Yeah, you were the one who found it. Yes, it, when I was up in Scotland. Yeah. Being Because that's the kind Quite of shit. Sick. That's, the, um, that's the shit he looks for when he's uh, a, alone, I guess. <laughs> For what are you implied, man? I have no idea. <laughs> okay, uh, I guess we should just get into it then. Just so you know, we're squished together. Detecting user profile. We're, we're squished together. Well, chair-wise. User profile, I'm... not for... Okay, so there, there's a, a quick save. What I presume is a load. But it's skip. probably a skip and auto. Mm. I told you there'd be typing. Yeah, for your name. Okay. What should your name be? Uh, it's got to be something marvellous. <laughs> just, just name at the start. My name is Name. <laughs> My name is Name. <laughs> uh, Dragon Rider 29 Sephira. <laughs> oh, this again. Um, I'm just going to have uh, to put fake text on here, am I? You fucking <laughs> bastard. You spent what, so much time on that for The Last Guardian. Um, I, I did. Name. Name. Shit. Um. um. <laughs> <laughs> this long period of awkwardness just over a name. Dragon um, Rider. Fuck off. It seems apt though, <laughs> does it not? Yeah, but fuck that. I think it seems appropriate. As we are do going to try. Oh, it's a name. It's not a username. Ladies and men's. Let's just go with my name. No, that's boring! Oh, fuck off. It's gotta be something great! Okay, fine. Fine. But you're coming up with it, and it's not something... F We're not going with Dragon Rider. Fuck that. But, 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 but it's great! I'm just gonna sip some Coke. <laughs> great names. Okay. Again, we're not sponsored. De Why would we sponsored. be? I've, I've got... <laughs> what? What? We don't even have a viewer base of able to, <laughs> you know. Okay. Um, um. Snap. Ah, <laughs> uh, let me think. Uh. I'm on <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, I, Hello, I, I'm horny. <laughs> Actually, yeah, sure, let's go with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you wrought this. You wrought this. Horn dog. We're going to be horny. Why not horn dog? Uh, we have to choose a colour. A colour? Red's the best colour. Red is the best colour. What, what? First, let's see, show more colours. Ah, boring. Just white. <laughs> boring. Ooh, maroon. <laughs> Very good colour for horny. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know that was going to happen, but okay. We, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah. User profile confirmed. Before we start, please review the following information. Use left click to enter to advance. Well, we kind of know that bit already. We've been Press doing it. Press space to advance text only. This is useful to avoid making a selection by mistake. Okay. Escape or right click brings up the menu. F toggles full screen. Use the mouse wheel or page up and page down to review past messages and now, rewind. If if we had been using my old keybinds for OBS, page up and page down would have fucked up the recording. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't use F12 to oh, stop recording. Oh god, what? Why is there a tutorial for? I fucking don't know. Text hold control or press S tab. S takes a screenshot. Uh, uh, <laughs> hold control or press tab to uh, middle. Okay. Um, you got it. So I'm not. Yeah, that that would, that'd be, would all. be all. Shark Thanks, system. system. <laughs> what a lovely, lovely thing. Why can't it have like the? You you know the, right. The, the year is twenty x x. Fascinating year. Yes. Only recently has humanity discovered a portal that leads into a different world, Woo! populated with a race of intelligent talking dragons. <laughs> of course. This is definitely a video game. Oh yes. I was one of a few to travel to this world. You're so we're, Okay, dramatic. so we're narrating, are we? This is the character. This narrating. is you. That's why you have to read it, because you are the player, motherfucker. I am assistant voices, okay? <laughs> but God. maybe. 
I should start at the beginning. Yeah, that's usually a good idea. You're with probably a wondering story. how I got into this situation. <laughs> <laughs> it all began when we discovered a strange device during, in, the, 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 in the middle of nowhere during one of our expeditions. A portal. Woo. Wait, so this portal just fucking existed already? Okay, who built it? Who knows? The the, the hey, oh, alien. That voice crack. Uh, <laughs> aliens. Aliens. I had heard about similar. Te- uh. Wait, what? They have similar. Te- <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> Though that had been more on an experimental level. Lovely. Mm, yay! That means probably people died. You're quieter than me, but fuck off. I can't do shit <laughs> about it. We're just fiddling it. with audio levels in the middle of it. Stop. But you're quieter than me. I don't want to <laughs> deal off. with that shit. Okay. Um, where was I? From what I knew, other portals had been created in the past and were under consideration for mass application. So what, they're just going to portal everywhere? Oh my <sighs> god. Holy shit. Let's hope it doesn't end up like the fly. That would As be pleasant. for this one in particular, though, we did mm. not know who had built it, nor when, or why we found it in the wilderness where we did. What was more exciting to us was the fact that it was functional. Holy shit! After our first test, we found there was someone else on the other side who was in possession of a similar portal. Well, yeah, portals usually do go to another one. Don't they? They speedy don't just lead thing into goes the in, of speedy nowhere. thing comes out. Unless it's a one way portal, but those suck. What? How would that work? You go in, you're in the same place. <laughs> <laughs> oh, excuse me. You just passed. This Coca Cola was a bad idea. Yay, guessy. <laughs> and our attempts at communication through letters were success. So you just happened to share a language. Oh, what a great coincidence. It's so convenient. But in the end, the machine's extraordinary demand for power meant we needed to act quickly as we wouldn't be able to keep the portal open much longer. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, that's a point. How is What's powering it? Does it have its own power? Who knows? Cell thing? When we made this known to the other side, we received a very unexpected reply. A letter of invitation. Please come by. We won't do anything, <laughs> I swear. <laughs> it's like that fucking Futurama feature length where they're like, the other universe is dating them. <laughs> what? Yeah, like at the end of Bender's, I can't remember the name, but but like Bender time travels and it tears open a, a, um, a rift to another universe and that you, I'll explain it later. Um, okay. After some deliberation, it was decided to accept their hospitality and send a person to the other side. The that other person side. was me. Oh, and that person was you. There was an individual Lovely. who took the job almost immediately. Why are they so enthusiastic? Because I don't know. Is that you? Oh, he's so handsome. Huh. <laughs> he's nothing like you. Oh God, the name. Shit. Reza. Is Cuerdo. <laughs> is that like spa That must be Spanish. Mo- or Mexican. Maybe that's the... Did it say another dude? Wait, what? I'm, I'm not paying attention. What? Never mind. I knew him. That is another father guy. had known him. We attended the same school and even had a few classes together. We would never really work very, cl- <laughs> very <laughs> close <laughs> friends, but we talked to each other occasionally and hung around with the same crowd sometimes. However, we still went our separate ways in the end. Shame. I wasn't sure what to think about the whole thing, but he had to have known what he was doing. He certainly was brave. I mean, what if they were fucking cannibals? Holy shit! Oh Either that or just very, very foolish. <laughs> I'm going to go with foolish. foolish. Yeah. All that shit about being the first to do something. Well, started. I wasn't sure which. His courage was applauded by others. After all, he couldn't possibly have known who or what would await him on the other end of the portal. And if he did meet someone there, who knew what kind of intentions they might have? It's just a fucking tentacle monster. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> it's it's alternative universe Japan where all their weird shit comes to life. Oh god, that sounds horrifying. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, the world would be doomed. Mm-hmm. Not that any speculation on our part would have made a difference. What, when the what, dive what? D- die die, <laughs> the day finally came. Through he went with applause echoing across the area, equipped only with the clothes he wore, his multi tool, a gun. 
Okay, yep. you're kind of assumptive uh-huh. there. And a well, device then. on his wrist that acted as a PDA. Okay, so how far in the future? Okay, so they say 20XX, so it's clearly sometime in the future. Yeah. Ah, no, I'm too quiet. Then we waited. And waited. The crowd that was applauding him slowly dispersed when the enthusiasm died down, as there was nothing for us to do but wait and speculate. <laughs> Approximately eight hours later, I counted precisely, it was definitely eight hours, Just we received our very first message from him. I did not, I put the very in there by accident. <laughs> yeah. Well, we had assumed the portal emphasize. led to another in a different country, or maybe on a different continent, the reality turned out to be much more foreign. It was France! Not France! The worst location, because in this world, France has been taken over by evil baguettes. <laughs> the frogs are attacking with the baguettes. <laughs> and just riding on snails. The situation he described to us was so outlandish that we initially took it as a joke. Oh, funny joke. A very joke. bad joke, maybe. With even worse timing and no punchline at all. Yeah, where was the punchline? Georgie, I need to punch you. No. Oh, that really hurt. Oh, come on, that was he, light. He punched my fist. That wasn't even a fist bump. That hurt. <laughs> it soon became clear to us, though, that he we may have just have made one of the most important discoveries since the dawn of mankind. There be dragons. <laughs> Finally, the portal had been remarkable in itself, but this took it to a completely different level. Level two. Holy shit. <laughs> From what he described about the place, or more, accu- bleh, more accurately, its inhabitants, we surmised it could not be part of Earth at all. Well, Half of this place was just going to be me stumbling on words and going, nah, or uh, something. We did not do proper exercises with our mouths before no, we, we began. Didn't. We did no lip flapping. <laughs> we <laughs> called <laughs> them dragons, because according to Razor, that's what they were, or at least what they resembled most. Okay, what do they call That's... themselves? Do they call themselves dragons too? I don't know. <laughs> Even though we found it hard to believe, it had been these dragons who sent us all the letters. And what Razor found on the other side of the portal was a whole civilization of them. They could talk, write books. Why is that needed? Had buildings ele- and electricity. In many ways, their society was actually very similar so to our own. So it's just a parallel Except dimension. Except they ate each other. There's a parallel dimension where... The only difference is that they're dragons, apparently. Okay, so who were they? Where was this place? Could they be aliens? Well, technically, yes, they are, because the definition of an alien is like... It doesn't have to be from space, does it? So, yeah, they are aliens. It's like illegal... We're fucking aliens to them. We're the aliens here. Holy shit! We're the invaders! Invaders from... Uh, Not Mars. From the planet called Earth that really should be called water because it's mostly water. Planet water! Science! Science, bitch! We keep making it. Our planet. speculations led us to conclude otherwise. After all, we knew about the existence of thousands of planets, millions of light years away that may have been theoretically habitable. Yet even then, we had never found conclusive proof in regards to actual alien life forms. I just established that they're aliens anyway. Oh, now you're moving it away. Fuck We you. keep clipping. <laughs> well, you kept fiddling with the levels. Yeah, my levels. Oh, okay. Not yours. Some people brought up quantum mechanics and parallel universes, but in the end of all this, it was just conjecture and an ultimately fruitless endeavour, since we neither had the means nor the resources to explore these possibilities in greater detail. I'm glad you're so reading. So go the fuck through. I'm glad you're reading and not me. <laughs> yeah, well, we know from you reading my books that you're pretty bad at it. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, she proofreads my books. She's slow as shit. Thank you. I mean, it's been like, what? Almost a month since I finished, and you're only on the second chapter. Well. And you take like four hours to get through one chapter. Two hours. Okay, I may have exaggerated, but... Oh, doesn't matter. I think there's one Read. more thing worth mentioning before I move on. The previous isolation had been mutual. Okay. 
They hadn't known about any other intelligent life form beyond their own. Their portal had only recently been discovered and was a technology previously unknown to them. And just as we had myths about dragons, they had mi- they just have myths those, about those, these those fucking ski- these furless ape things. That, <laughs> what? Okay, what that's weird. They? I want to know what that's like. What? They, 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 we're. So they. Why is this so write, coincidental? We, write, we have myths about dragons. There are dragons, so and the dragons have myths about us. How does that make Lord of the Rings happen? Like Smaug and shit, and like all those fantasy <laughs> epics where it's yeah. What are what are they going to think about all the fucking books we have where the men are killing the dragons? What are they going to think about that? <laughs> oh my god! What the fuck was that, Georgie? <laughs> I don't know. Good lord. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. That was uh, what we knew about them so far. And any inter- and as interesting as learning those things and debating their cultural significance was, we didn't really know what we should make of it all. Razor apparently was sure of what he was doing, though, as this he evidently let us know that they had minutes. agreed on a trip. <laughs> How long have we been recording? Minutes. Oh, fuck. <laughs> God, this is an long <laughs> trip. We were to give them a few of our PDA devices, which contained vast amounts of knowledge, dwarfing even that of encyclopedias. Well, encyclopedias don't really give much information, do they? No. In return, they would supply us with generators. Okay. What? Why don't we just give them Wikipedia? Give them the Wikipedia, because it is the most viable source of information, obviously. Overall, they didn't seem as technologically advanced as we had been, but they did surpass us in that one aspect. Their means of generating energy seemed sustainable. Not only that, but evidently also quite efficient. We certainly would be able to put technology like that to good use, and trading mere past knowledge of the human race for something more tangible was a good call on his part. What? What? What's the... Fl- oh, is it stopped? No. No, fuck. it's going on more. God, this exposition fart. <laughs> God. That was where I came in. My uh, prior yeah. experience in both biology... <laughs> and sociology. Oh, God. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> fuck. What the fuck. Fuck, why is it sociology? Shit. <laughs> made me a good fit to deliver our PDA devices for the trade, and while in the Dragon's World, waiting for the prototypes of our generators to be manufactured by them, I would act as an ambassador on human... Humanity! Humanity's behalf. What a way to make a first impression by a display of mutual goodwill. Everyone benefits, and everyone goes home happy. Yay! Except for Dave, that... Fucker, he's always upset, always moping about his wife and his kids. Nobody likes Dave. Fuck Dave. Not actually. All is well, except Except for Dave. Dave. (laughs) (laughs) At least that was the plan. Despite the images that Lorking... God, it keeps going! Lorking? (laughs) Fuck! Living, talking dragons might conjure up in some people's minds. I didn't even think of bringing a weapon myself, considering that they were reportedly friendly and peaceful enough. There was no need for me to fear potential ill intentions like Razor did when he had stepped into unknown territory and found Isis. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, God. (laughs) And acting as humanity's ambassador, I had to do my best to uphold a high standard in fostering this diplomatic relationship. My name is Horny. (laughs) 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 Great start. (laughs) Okay. When the time came... (laughs) Fuck. When the time came for me to step through the portal, all my mental preparedness vanished. My anxiousness was fueled by all the questions lurking in my head. Like, who the fuck called me horny? Just as the machine started to do its work. Would it hurt? Who would I meet on the other side? Why is my name so dumb? (laughs) What if they really weren't so friendly and just made Razor write those letters with the pretense of appearing friendly only to lure us into the den of man-eating monsters and certain doom with us ending up as nothing more than a tasty afternoon snack? See, I told you they're Dragon Isis! Maybe I should have brought a weapon after all. Ah. Oh, suddenly, I felt a shiver coursing throughout my whole body and beyond when I disintegrated as if every cell, every atom of my body was torn from me and pulled into a different direction. Is he going to appear naked like in Terminator? Does his clothes not transport? 
Is that it? Do we fight? No, fuck, there's more! Oh, God! I saw darkness and light, <laughs> painting patterns in the stars as I travelled, and images rapidly flashing before me of things unseen and unspoken. It was all porn! Oh, God! <laughs> the space between dimensions is porn! Porn, porn, porn. We're Both horrifying and beautiful. Away. It was an experience unlike any other, yet over in just a split second. Dun, dun, dun. Then it was dark. I could only see a patch of lighter colour contrasting with its dark surroundings. As my vision started to clear, its edges got sharper as a patch of light slowly took shape, giving me the distinguished outline of a reptilian head and an array of horns sprouting from it. Sprouting, <laughs> not sprouting. Hi, horns, Okay. It was a dragon! Holy shit! And as I could now see, a dragon who not only had a pair of round glasses, but also wore burgundy tie around its that neck. doesn't look like a tie. Who's voicing Rem- Rem- Remy? That's a dude's name, right? Uh, uh, no, I think sh- it's a she. Is it a she? Okay, uh, glasses, nerd, okay. In the name of our people, I bid you welcome. If I may introduce myself, I am Remy, your guide and ambassador, a representative of our council. They have a council? I guess so. Is it like Star Wars? <laughs> Please no. The fuck that. The dragon spoke! It was one thing to have heard and read about this, but something in- else entirely to have one standing in front of me in flesh and blood and tongue. Bleh. Then we kids. <laughs> it was I good that all my mental preparedness had disappeared when I was teleported. Me. Because nothing could have prepared me for this. Ah, I was drinking. Sorry, I imagined you might still feel the effects of the teleportation. Drowsiness or weakness is not unusual, as is fainting and spontaneous emptying of your bowels, bladder, or stomach. How do you feel? I shit my pants! (laughs) My name's Horny and I shit my pants! Hi, I'm Horny, I shit my pants! (laughs) Rendered speechless, I had totally forgotten that I was shouldering the burden of representing my people to them as well. (laughs) My name's Horny! We're never gonna get over that. (laughs) So much for being professional. Yeah, your name's fucking Horny! How did you get a job in the first place? (laughs) But at least he gave me... Oh, so he thinks he's a he as well. Gave me a good excuse for my blunder. Okay. Is it a he? <laughs> I think I'm all right. Well, I'm glad to hear that. Maybe we should go before it gets too dark. Come with me, please. Oh, it looks pretty the, dark right now. The voice, I'm losing the voice. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> so I followed the dragon, not straying too far from him, as the sun had already departed for the day. Just fucking packed its bags and left. What? Like that old fucking nursery rhyme. No, it's, it's what, like it? they're in the big blue house when they say hello to the sun and goodbye to the moon and all that crap. Yeah. It's great. And the remaining light diminished by the minute. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the immersive working effects. It is getting hard to see where I'm going. And by hard. <laughs> Sorry about that, but we had good reason to schedule your arrival like this. We did not want you to be ambushed by a crowd, so we had to keep your exact time and date of arrival secret. I'm losing the voice. Thanks. I suppose an event like this would make me a celebrity of sorts. It would be the same if one of you came to us and we fucking dissect you for science. Science! My name's Horny! (laughs) We're gonna have to have a fucking my name's Horny counter. (laughs) That's quite an understatement. Some people here are rather superstitious. They might regard you or any of your kind as divide, I suppose. I'm God. My <laughs> name's Horny. <laughs> I'm Horny and I'm God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, really? How so? We do have certain myths that involve humans and as such. Oh, I suppose the history lesson will have to wait and for another time. Here we are. My mum started hoovering. <laughs> Feck. Ignore it. Let's go. Keep going. By this point, it had gotten so dark that I could barely make out the building before us. I briefly wondered whether they might have street lights elsewhere, or if they just did not require any due to possible enhanced eyesight or night vision. They're just like predator. These these uh, <laughs> these environments look suspiciously sized for humans. Unless I don't know if the size of the dragons. I yet. think the dragons are probably human sized. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Tiny they little human-sized dragons. 
I could vaguely see the dragon, his light colours still visible within the blackness that engulfed the area. Why are there so many black people? Oh my god! <laughs> I thought this place was inhabited by dragons! <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we gotta be careful, or the SJW is gonna be on to us. Yeah, <laughs> be careful. You know what, fuck them. Rear up and. and, and uh, there. Talk normally now. Rear up and manipulate the door handle with one of his four paws. Manipulate? Is he like Magneto? <laughs> he can't! He can't <laughs> hold it properly, so he's just. Yeah. Uh, that's a squeaky door. You should oil it. Oh, oh apparently we have a candy floss <clears throat> flower. Yay! <laughs> Beautiful. Hinges creaking, the door opened, and with the flick of a switch, the apartment was flooded with light, blinding me after all the time we had just spent without it. This is where you will live for the time being. If it's fully stocked, uh, it is fully stocked, but in case you need anything else, I left you a note with a few phone numbers. One of them is for porn. <laughs> <laughs> the phone sex and all that. It is getting rather late, so I'll have to take my leave now. In any case, you will come and I will. Someone will. <laughs> in any case, someone will. <laughs> I, <laughs> someone will come and meet you tomorrow morning. <laughs> I, uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Remy. Have a good night. Until we meet again, Horny. <laughs> 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 With a nod, Remy left the apartment, mindful enough to close the door behind himself. So why, why wouldn't oh, my he? my tail! <laughs> <laughs> Surveying the room, I considered the events that had just transpired as my gaze met the window. But was it the really window, a window? To the wall, to the sweat drop. I could see movement outside, and as I drew nearer, startled, I could hear footsteps in the grass moving away quickly. Assuming it must have been the dragon I just met, I thought nothing of it. So I went to bed and slowly succumbed to the sweet allure of sleep over dew. But first I must wank! <laughs> <laughs> I spent a I few moments thinking all. about my role, my mission, and what it meant to be here now. I couldn't stop thinking, but my name's fucking horny! It turns me off. <laughs> <laughs> I felt the responsibility placed on my shoulders. I was eager for the adventure to come. I'm too my calm. Pants. <laughs> <laughs> now what? Oh, oh, this is a choice. I thought this was text. Uh, oh, ow. Um, what paper scissors? No, I no. mean, what do you think? He's got. He's responsible for this, but then it's like, oh shit, dragons are so fucking cool. How do you want to have this character be? Well, he's horny, so he's eager. <laughs> okay. So many possibilities and prospects <laughs> race through my mind. Truth be told, the thought of being able to meet an entirely new species and civilization excited me, as I was going to be one of the first to truly experience their society with its own little quirks, differences, and similarities. I couldn't help but feel like some sort of modern Vasco da Gama. Who the fuck is Vasco da Gama? I don't know. <clears throat> or Marco Polo. Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! <laughs> I remember playing through Uncharted 2. Oh, when we play through that, uh, uh, if, you'll see when we get to that bit, but it's, it's fun. We've got so many games to do, though. Oh, yeah, we have too much planned. <laughs> yeah. We're going to be filling this whole months, year with shit. Maybe a year. Maybe I would even write a book about the whole experience. Stop stealing my job, man! <laughs> Fuck you! I will exploit what I've done for money and success. Even more than I have now. Uh, <laughs> About the whole experience after it's all over. I was sure it would become a hit, all things considered. At any rate, this was going to be fun. Fat, 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 fat. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't work with headphones. <laughs>